drugs and the cash out. Don't make me lash and blast out. In these times of desperation, I gotta eat on a verge of starvation. Hungry ain't never seen a meal with the kill over a crumb. I be the first one to go in your mouth. The last one you thought to be the tape in your spouse. Pouring kerosene throughout the house to make it flammable. Plus your bitch is highly gameable. Alright guys, Vision Pictures here and welcome to another tutorial. Uh, this tutorial is about the Twitch effect in Vegas. Yeah, you won't need any plugins and I've already been doing uh, the Cod Field Clip, the Cod 4 <laughs> Clip with uh, its gun sounds and syncing the clip and the pan crap to the music. And also I was doing the color corrections. Or the color correction. And yeah. Now I'm going to show you how to do that Twitch effect in Vegas. Hungry ain't never seen a male put the kill over a crumb. I be the first one to go in your mouth. The last one you thought would be the tape in your spouse. Pouring kerosene throughout the house to make a Alright, so as you can see it's already synced. And um here's the part where we where we're going to add the Twitch effect. So, you have to select your clip, right click, or just click on the small button there. Go to stereoscopic 3D mode and change it to analyze glyphish red and cyan. You will see what I mean. You can also choose the other two, but yeah, and as you can see, it's now a little bit more gray, so add some saturation and to the clip and just, uh, yeah, just put the lowest value for the low lights to. 1% or to 1.0. Create a copy of your clip and then go to the part where you want to have your effect. You're going to cut the clip where you want the effect to start and where you want it to end. Do a fade in or a fade out. Choose any type you want, and then you have to add the TV simulator, and you're going to put the value in. As you can see, 0.95 or 0.9. Going to pre-render it and have a look. As you can see, it's a little shaky. That's what we want. Now you're going to add the stereoscopic 3D uh, stuff, <laughs> and you can, yeah, you can do a zoom. But for now, we're going to do the horizontal offset to about 128 or 256 or something like that. So 0 0.0256 or something like that. Going to pre-render it and have another look. And as you can see, we already have this kind of twitch effect. Alright, looking good, I think. Yeah, here I was finishing the pan crop. And now I think we could add the gun sounds so that it, yeah, it sounds more synced. Actually, a little bit loud. Still too loud. Yeah, I think that's fine. And then just copy paste it by uh, pressing Ctrl and dragging it to the parts where I want to have the shots. Pretty good, I think. Yeah. 
Twitch effect looking good, but still not finished. We're going to add some pan crap to the Twitch effect now. So click on the last frame, or the first frame where you have your shot. Move forward for like two frames and then move your pan crop to the top and to the left. And zoom a little bit in. And move forward for another two frames and do the fame, but now put it to the right side. And now zoom a little bit out and put it on the bottom. Like that, yeah. And zoom a little bit out again. Then move forward and put it to the left or the bottom. Oh, we actually move backward now. Gotta do it the right way. One more check. Go forward for like two frames now. Put it to the bottom, to the left. Zoom a little bit out. Yeah, like that. And for now, move forward like three or four frames. Put it in the center or in the middle. And zoom a little bit out again. I think. Yeah, that's fine. Alright. And this is the pan crop part of the Twitch effect. And now you gotta copy these and add them to the other clip where we have the effect on. You can copy and paste with Ctrl C and Ctrl V. Pre render. Alright, thank you guys for watching. I hope I was able to help you or to show you how to do the the, the Twitch effect in Vegas. If you have any questions, please uh, write them in the comments below the video. And if you want to see how the Twitch effect works in uh, After Effects, and there you need the plugin called Twitch Effect by Video Copilot, then I can do another video as well. Hope you enjoyed, see you next time.